With shoulder cars, you'll first begin by starting down at your side and reaching forward and out as far as you can. And then you'll make one big circle with your arm, continuing to reach as far as you can. And eventually to reach further, you'll have to turn that hand so the palm is away from the wall and you can go all the way back. When your shoulders start to twist like this, that's when you should stop the motion, turn the palm back over, and then come back down. The whole time you are reaching out, feeling all those muscles in the shoulder start burning. Ankle cars are similar to hip and knee cars in which you're just making a large circle with the joint. So let me show you ankle cars. Here, you want to start by pushing the ankle as far down as it goes. And then you want to make one big circle, bringing it up as far as it goes, in as far as it goes, back down, out, up, in, down. And what you want to avoid is using the leg to get all the motion. So you don't want to roll that leg in order to get the motion. You want it just coming from the ankle. With hip cars, you'll be doing the same thing as shoulder cars, making one big circle with the joint, activating all the muscles, and you really start to feel the burn. So let me show you. First, bring the knee to your chest. Open the book, twist that leg back, and make one big circle with the leg. So you start to center, bring that leg straight, and start over again. Knee cars are a little bit different than hip and shoulder cars, as those joints are ball and sockets, and the knee does not involve as much motion. So what you'll do is you'll brace the thigh with your hands, and you can use your foot as an indicator to look at the rotation of your lower leg. So as you turn that foot out, you wanna make sure that that lower leg is rotating. Kick straight as far as you can, bend it back, rotate the other direction, making sure that the lower leg is still moving and it's not just the ankle, and then kick out straight again, bend it back, and keep repeating that, working on knee mobility.